I want to talk about even and odd functions. First, a definition. A function f is even if f of negative x equals f of x for all x in the domain of f. That means that you can switch x for negative x and get the same value. Now, what kind of symmetry does that give us? Well, the graph of an even function is always going to be symmetric with respect to the y-axis. Why is that? Well, if you remember our discussion of symmetry, of uh, reflections, the, the graph of y equals f of negative x, y equals f of negative x, is a reflection about the y-axis. If the reflection about the y-axis of a function is exactly same, the same as the function itself, then it's symmetric about the y-axis. Now let's look at two examples from our parent functions. There's y equals x squared, and there's y equals the absolute value of x. Now odd functions. Function f is odd if f of negative x equals the opposite of f of x. This means that opposite inputs give opposite outputs. Now, if this is true, the graph of an odd function will be symmetric with respect to the origin. What that means is you could take the graph, rotate it 180 degrees, and it'll look exactly the same. So it's 180 degrees sym symmetry about the origin. Now some examples from our parent functions are y equals x, y equals x cubed, and also y equals 1 over x. So remember, odd functions, opposite inputs have opposite outputs. Even functions, opposite inputs have the same output. Even functions are sy symmetric about the y-axis. Odd functions are symmetric about the origin.